y'all so good afternoon i'm about to go get my nails done i have to take these press-ons off though first because i've been wearing press-ons for like two weeks y'all but i don't know what design i get i usually always get like something with french tip and i know i'm just so boring and i'll be having a crazy design i'll be wanting to take it off next week because i'm tired of it that's the problem i think i'm gonna ask for a white french tip don't yell at me but i'm going to tell her to put some flowers on there like with the little bling make like some flowers on the white french tip i feel like that would be cute and i don't know what length i'm gonna get i think i'm gonna get like medium so i'm gonna go ahead and go over there i have not ate nothing y'all and it's already 3 30 but i'm gonna get a smoothie before my nail appointment and then i'm gonna get something to eat after my nail appointment i have stuff to make empanadas but i might make that tomorrow tomorrow i'm getting my lashes done at 11 in the morning i think my appointment is so yeah y'all i'm gonna go ahead and i'm gonna go get the smoothie first and then get my nails done so yeah but i gotta take these press-ons off i called a salon and i was like it's so so available today for a full stay and they was like yeah you can come right now i said i'm on the way so i gotta go now because I said I was like only five minutes away and I was lying, so. y'all so i'm back home she did my nails so fast but they are so freaking cute there's different colors on both sides at first i was gonna get flowers on all the nails but i was like mm, i get tired of stuff fast so i only got them on two nails but tomorrow y'all i'm getting my lashes done at 11 o'clock in the morning so i gotta go to sleep today at a decent time because i've been going to sleep late because y'all i'm not gonna lie i've been feeling sad and when i feel sad i'll be up all night because like the world is sleeping so that's my time to myself but i also feel like i'm happy that i'm getting myself together because i do feel like when you look better you feel better not saying that i don't look good without lashes and like that. i'm just saying you know like just doing self-care maintenance because y'all know i always did self-care maintenance all the time and my mind has been overthinking about so much other stuff i'm happy that i'm taking the time to like really put me first so my appointment tomorrow is at 11 in the morning and i'm going to somebody different i don't want to cheat on my lash tech y'all so my lash tech if you're watching this we're locked in i promise you i don't want to cheat on you but she's far from me y'all know i got into that car accident and my car was total so i'm going through the whole process of the case because y'all know the accident was not my fault and they left on the scene so that's why my case is taking a little bit longer because like you don't actually know the people's names who hit you you just know the person who rented the car they was in so it's the whole thing y'all so i'm trying this new lash tag who's closer to me but it's my first time going to her i booked for mega volume and bottom lashes because i feel like whenever i get my lashes done i need bottoms but i'll probably get my longest length like 16. i'm sad i'm not going to my lash tag either y'all i promise you i'm a loyal client like when i have a good energy with somebody who does like service or whatever like we really click so when i have to go to somebody else it really makes me sad i'm doing that tomorrow i want to blow out my hair because i've been wearing my hair the same way for months like i have not done my hair differently i have not switched it up so i do want to blow my hair out and flat iron it which is not a good idea because right now it's currently 74 degrees in florida and it's been hot so it's not a good idea to do myself like a little suppress but i do want something different to my hair and it's too hot for a lace front right now but i might get one because i'm not gonna lie to you i've been wanting blonde hair and i'm not dying my hair blonde so a little cute 613 maybe toned like an ash blonde color would be so cute so i might get one installed like later on in the summer but right now mm -mm. so i'm gonna blow my hair out and 
press it out but i want to do a side part instead of a middle part i could blow it out tonight so tomorrow is already done but i might do it tomorrow after my lash appointment blowing my hair out doesn't really take as long as i used to because i know how to do it better the most part is the actual blowing it out with the blow dryer brush because for me the way my hair looks the best when i straighten it is if i take my time when i blow it out and i hate blowing my hair out because my hair takes forever to dry in general so even when a blow dryer it takes forever to dry so i'm gonna figure so i'm gonna figure that out you know <laughs> I'm gonna blow out my hair tonight or tomorrow. I'm not sure yet. But it's currently 10.34. I'm gonna leave at 10.40. And I'm trying to give my dad sure time because um, it says that they're on the way, but they've been on the way for mad long, so. I'm not gonna do my eyebrows like how I usually do them because when you put your lashes in, you're not supposed to have nothing on your face, like no cream or nothing like that. So I'm not gonna put no product on my face. Some lotion. As y'all can see, this is my favorite lotion. It smells so good, y'all. It's the Jergens Oil Infused Deep Conditioning Shade and Cocoa Water Blend. And this smells so good. Y'all, and can you guys believe that I lost my Burberry hair? It gotta be in my suitcase somewhere, but I got the big bottle, so it was the most expensive one, and I don't know where it's at. I took it to Coppa with me, and I know I packed it in my suitcase for sure, but where it's at, I don't know, so yeah. I'm gonna use my Valentino. I'm gonna get a big bottle of this, because it's my favorite perfume, so I'm gonna get the big bottle of this one, and I'm gonna find that Burberry hair, because I know I have it somewhere. All right, y'all. I'm gonna go downstairs. As y'all can see, my lashes are done. Y'all, I love them. They are dramatic, and y'all probably like, girl, they're so dramatic, but y'all, they're mega volume. That's what mega volume is. They look so good. I got bottoms too, so I got natural bottoms, and I got mega volume. The longest length is 16, and there's a little cat eye going on, you know what I'm saying? But I love them, and I get mega volume sets because I like my lashes to last a long time. I already booked my filling appointment just so I can be consistent again with getting my lashes in. They make me happy, so yeah and y'all i literally fell asleep she gave me a blanket and everything i was chilling but i went to ross because ross was actually next door to where it was at and i got me a shower caddy i needed a new one for my shower because right now all my showers i was on my shower bench and i use that bench to like sit down in the shower or to put my legs on them when i shave them so i want the stool to be empty so i bought this so i can go ahead and put my shower products on the shower caddy and it was only ten dollars so yeah and my hair looks so flat right now because i was laying down but i think i'm about to blow out my hair after i show y'all this and then i also got some cute pajama sets like loungewear because i feel like a big part of my self-care is when i go take a shower take a long shower exfoliate do my skin routine and then i put on some qpjs like it feels so much better although like most of the time yeah like sleeping naked is like obviously the best option but like if you want to just feel cute just feel good in the house you know you can have some qpjs so i got this set it has the shorts that come with it that was like 15 dollars and this one is so cute. These are the shorts. And these are like basically panties. Like on me, they're gonna be panties. So, but these are the shorts. And this is the top. And it has adjustable straps. I'm telling you, I don't see my Ross if you want some cute, like lounge stuff. Marshalls, J Max, Ross, Burlington. You can only get cute um, pajamas anywhere, honestly. And then I got a new robe because I was tired of wearing my black one and my white one. I have no idea where it's at. <sighs> but 
it's whatever. I ended up drinking my coffee on the way to the appointment because I only got a grande, so I was able to drink it on time because the door dasher was right on time when I was about to leave. So I was like, oh girl, you can't close because I was gonna go. But I'm gonna eat real quick and then I'm going to take a shower. I also got this loungewear set from Amazon. It's like a little run of errands outfit. I'm gonna try it on after I get out of the shower. I wanted to get different colors, but I only got one so far because I wanna see if it fits me right in that size. And then if it fits me, I will get more colors in it. Cause I'm gonna start buying pieces from my closet cause I haven't, why did I pay for chips at Subway and I didn't even grab the chips? I forgot. Yeah, I'm gonna start buying pieces from my closet. Like bags that I've been wanting, shoes I've been wanting, shirts, like clothes, so that when I do go somewhere, I actually have clothes. Cause I have not bought, like a shopping spree for myself, I have not bought no pieces for myself. And when I'm talking about shoes, I'm not meaning like sandals or like heels. I'm talking about like pieces, like when it's time to put that sh on. If somebody else is like, oh, I want these shoes, I want this shirt, I get it. But when it comes to me, I'll be like, oh no, I gotta focus on other stuff. And I focus on everything. So now it's a time that I keep doing what I'm focusing on but give back to myself well I could have been gave back to myself but I feel guilty sometimes so I'm off of that right now right now I want to prioritize myself and get stuff that I've been wanting you know I love wearing stuff like my little zip ups and my running errands outfits like I love wearing like workout clothes I love wearing all that stuff so I still need my basics in my closet because nine times out of ten when I'm filming and I'm vlogging I'm wearing basics and I'm wearing loungewear so that's stuff that I need Still, that's why I bought two new sets, but I gotta just see how they fit me before I get more. I'm gonna get in the shower, y'all. My aunt gonna come over. We're gonna get something to eat and be chilling in the house. I just got out of the shower. I'm flossing my teeth because I ate that so. It's hard flossing my bottom because I have the permanent retainer. Yeah, it's so sunny outside because we're currently in golden hour. It's 5.30, so that's why the sun is beaming so fast. I meant so much but i'm gonna try to do my hair as fast as i can because me and my aunt want to go eat so i obviously wouldn't want to have her waiting on me the whole time so yeah i'm about to get my ipad i put the avocado oil and the heat protectant before i start blow drying it i don't know how well it actually protects my hair but i just be doing it just because i guess i put a lot on my ends because that's where my hair would get damaged at that was a lot. Mm -hmm. And then I put avocado oil. I'm trying to get that shine when I blow it out. Put a little bit more. I have thick hair, so I don't be stingy on the products. Put a lot on my ends and really put it through my scalp. I'm going to do it by size because when I do it the other way, I feel like it takes forever. And I'm gonna just twist it. Okay. Y'all, change of plans. I'm not gonna have time to to blow out my hair. So I'm about to wet it and just style it curly because I'm not gonna have time and I just wanna be realistic. And the way I want it to be straight in it, I really want it to be really cute because I wanna make content with it straight. So I wanna be realistic and actually do it when I have time. So I'm gonna straighten it tomorrow after I pack orders. So I'll just beat my face today and straighten it tomorrow. Y'all, the light is like in my face. The light is just, it's trying to light today. So, but I was really gonna blow it out. I have my brush and everything. Let me take my little twist out that I did. Now, I really swear I was gonna do it today, but realistically, I was not gonna have time. So I'm just gonna style it. Like I'm gonna put this hair up in a clip, kind of how like it's already laying right now, but I'm gonna style my hair in the bottom and then I'm gonna do like a high claw clip like this. With my face beat, I feel like it's gonna be so cute with these pieces hanging. So I'm gonna take my Auntie Jackie's curl la la. My hands are like slippery. Auntie Jackie, I love you, girl. And I'm gonna put it through my hair. And I'm gonna just brush this side, or this half, I should say. I'm gonna just scrunch. I'm gonna take some gel. And I'm gonna put it on the side. Just so it could be a neat hairstyle. I don't want it to be messy because my hair is already out. Oh lord, I don't know how y'all began your claws. I don't know how y'all began your claw clips to clip because my hair 
not me clipping. Maybe I'm twisting it too much. You have to twist it looser maybe. But if I twist it loose, it's not tight. Let me do it off camera and come back. This is the hairstyle, y'all. This is a claw clip, the two pieces, and then my hair down. I put a lot of product in the back so it can stay like flat because my hair is going to pull up. But I think it's cute. So now y'all, I'm going to beat my face and get ready. Like I said, we're not going nowhere fancy, y'all. We're going to be going somewhere that has burgers and milkshakes. But it's so good. And I don't need the house much. So anything that will give me a reason to beat my face and put some makeup on and use my own products, I'm going to do it. So that's what I'm going to do. The lighting is so bright. I'm sorry it is too much, but I'm gonna start on my makeup now. I'm moisturizing first, obviously, with my CeraVe. Y'all should know my routine by now. Like, cause on TikTok, y'all been asking me for an updated makeup tutorial, but it hasn't changed. The sun should be going down soon, so hopefully it's not gonna be that bright. But I'm blinding y'all. I do my eyebrows with my True Edge. What's the difference? I'm gonna take this robe off, so I don't wanna dirty it. I feel like I'm in the Vogue makeup routine video or whatever routine video they be doing. I don't know. My last check that I went to today, she asked me how do I do my makeup with bottoms on. For me, it's not hard, but if I get makeup on my bottoms, I just take a Q-tip and I just wipe it off. Y'all, the light is finally starting to go down, so now y'all could see me better. And I wish I had some makeup wipes because I don't want to get my lashes wet when I take my makeup off. Cause it's not time yet that I can wear them. I'm gonna put some the dark one on here too. Oh my gosh, like ugh, makeup with lash extensions just hits different. Like it really does. Every time I do my concealer, I make this face. my lip combo if you're new here and you don't know what kaylin collection is kaylin collection is my brand my business currently we have launched the it girl collection which is four cream glosses so they're creamy they're thick they're pigmented and three smooth lip liners and when i say smooth i mean smooth like goes on like butter baby okay and not only are they super cute you can sharpen them because i don't like the twisty lip liners i don't do those i do the sharpen ones i'm old school so today i feel like using cocoa so you can shop kaylin collection k-a-e-l-y-n collection.com and it's also in my description y'all they go on so smooth that's the liner and now i'm gonna use my cream gloss in the shade blush I'm more it adds more pigment because it is stackable for people who don't like too too much but if you want extra pigment you could just do extra swatches on your lip and it would be more pigmented but i want it a little lighter so i'm gonna mix birthday suit which you can use it as a base if you want to put the other colors on top of the birthday suit so that way it's a lighter in general but i'm gonna just add a little bit on top like literally a dab because birthday suit is very pigmented and it's very light it's the lightest one and i did that on purpose so it could be a base or you could mix them so it could make any shade of lip gloss you want lighter instead of using concealer because it's 2023 stop putting concealer on your lips to get the designated lip combo just get birthday suit and you will be okay yeah, I added birthday suit and now it's lighter and I only literally put a dab because it's so pigmented. Alright y'all, so now I'm about to just set my face one more time so it could be good throughout the day. And then we're done. Ooh baby, look at that forehead girl. It's okay. Alright y'all, I'm gonna get dressed. I'll be back. Alright y'all, I'm all ready as y'all can see. But before I go, I need to accessorize. So I'm going to be opening up my package from Flair & Co. It's so cute y'all, look. Flair & Co is jewelry that is water resistant and hypoallergenic so your neck don't gotta turn green. And it shows y'all how to clean them. I know that's right. And in the package they have pink cloths that are so cute so you can take care of your jewelry. And they gave me a little scrunchie. Here's my jewelry pieces. I got some butterfly earrings. I'm gonna wear this. It's the heart piece, y'all. It's so cute. I'm gonna wear this. I'm gonna go my outfit because I have silver on my nose. I have two rings that I'm about to put on. Heart to match my necklace. I have another ring. So cute. I'm gonna put on the other side. 
I have this and it could be used I think as an anklet and a bracelet but I'll probably use it as a bracelet since I'm wearing the heart jewelry today but that's so cute see how cute and dainty it is and then I have two anklets one gold tennis chain and one silver this is the tennis bracelet anklet so cute and I have the same one in gold I'm gonna put my earrings on and then my necklace the good thing about Fleur & Co is that they have over 200 pieces that are water resistant so you can wear it without your neck or ear all that stuff turning green and the materials that are used doesn't make your skin itch because they are hypoallergenic so that way your skin doesn't get irritated your skin is not turning brown or green through time so that way your quality of your jewelry is better because you're not gonna wear it one time and throw it away but it's still affordable so it's perfect and y'all know spring coming up i live in florida so in spring it's hot and you can go to the pool you can go to the beach so that's why flaring co is good because you can go do all that stuff without worrying about your jewelry going to waste these are my butterfly earrings y'all and the heart is magnetic y'all how cool is that but I love it because it's just so cute and dainty. And you don't have to do too much, but they still have statement pieces, which is perfect for me. I think I'm going to wear the anklet as a bracelet because you can tighten it up. We love that. And y'all know I always come through. So if you guys go to flareaccessories.com, you guys can get 15% off your first order. And enter the promo code Mariah. Get that 15% off your first order. And like I said, they're very affordable. So that 15% off is going to do a lot, okay? Because it's already affordable, high-quality pieces. Y'all can get that. Like I said, it is off from Flare & Co. So thank y'all so much, Flare & Co. Smile in this video and giving me these super cute pieces but i'm already so thank y'all for getting ready with me because i'm gonna go and get something to eat my aunt just got here but yeah y'all this the look so lip combo from candy collection don't forget to shop hey y'all so it's the next day it's the afternoon i'm currently fresh out the shower and I'm real comfy today. I got my my lashes are a little bit wet because I just got the shower. And I am going to blow my hair out tonight. But right now I'm letting it dry up in the claw clip. Because when I was going to blow dry yesterday, I realized that I'm blow drying it while it's drying. And it's going to take forever. Which that one piece that I ended up doing took forever. So now I'm going to just blow dry it while it's damp or dry. It could be almost dry. Like as long as it's not all the way dry and I could just blow dry it to get the nice smooth results. So I want to apply iron it's easier. That's better. But today, I got a package orders before I do that, and it's already 4.50. So hopefully, when I do start blow drying my hair, the sun is down. Because yesterday, when I was trying to film me doing all that stuff, the sun was, I feel like it was giving me bad lighting in the room. Um, So right now, I'm about to just eat lunch. I door dash me some Popeyes, which I should not be eating no Popeyes. I need to be cooking. So I need to order groceries, which I'm going to be doing tonight. I'm going to be doing my hair tonight, so I'm not going to be cooking nothing. But I do want to make some empanadas, because I already have the stuff. I'll probably make those this weekend but on DoorDash you can't select what sauce you want so I don't have no sauce I'm gonna have to use sauce with some water dish. after I'm done eating lunch I'm gonna package some orders I want to wake up early in the morning and go to the post office and ship those out so that way I can make content without worrying about packaging the orders they didn't give me no straw for my drink and I was gonna get a frozen lemonade but it probably would have been not frozen by the time I got it why would they not give me no option for a sauce like this dry biscuit I do want to try the strawberry one and I wanted the black and ranch. It's bad time to blow my hair out because it's hot in Florida. It's like 80 something degrees and it's hot and my hair is probably gonna sweat out. I'm tired of wearing my hair the same way. I really am. I'm so bored with it. I'm probably only gonna have it straight in for a few days anyway because knowing me, I get bored with having it straight. I get bored with having it curly. I get bored with any hairstyle. So it's probably not gonna be straight for long because it's gonna be hard to maintain. But I be in the house so it really shouldn't be sweating out like that. But there's only so much you could do to straight hair. I'm gonna run out of hairstyles real quick. And once you put product on your silk press, like you have to watch it, cause if you keep restraining it, not a good look. I really wanna try this hairstyle that I've seen. It's kinda like what I did yesterday with straight hair. So yeah, you see it? See how you gotta put product on it? I'll probably do that when the hair blowout is on its last day. And I'm gonna wash my hair soon. Cause next week, is it next week? Yeah. Next weekend, my mom is coming down, and it's my nephew's birthday, so we're going to be in the sun, in the water and stuff, so my hair is not going to blast at all after I blow it out. And I will actually talk to y'all when I'm about to blow dry my hair, which is going to be later tonight. So.
All right, y'all, so I'm done packing all my orders for now. I'm about to blow dry my hair. It should be not as wet. It definitely is still wet, and it's already 10 o'clock, y'all. It just turned 10 02. I told y'all my hair takes forever to dry, but it's not like drenched how it would be out the shower, but it's still pretty wet. Now I'm about to go ahead and put some avocado oil and heat protecting it for real this time. I put some of my hair yesterday for no reason because I had to rewash it again today. So. The problem is, y'all, I don't have a rat tail comb. So that's going to be an issue when I start flat ironing it because the way I got it really good last time was when I had the rat tail comb and I was able to really get it nice and flat. But I don't have one, so I'm going to have to use a brush or something. My hair is done being blown out. I'm about to straighten it and instead of doing it how I usually do it, which is from the bottom section to the top, I'ma just do one side and another side because I feel like it makes time go by faster for me. So that's how I'm gonna do it. So I'm about to go ahead and straighten my hair and I will see you guys when I'm all done. Diamonds in the watch. This costs a lot. Never send a dot. That's how you get shot. I DM in vanish mode. I do that a lot. The panties off and it's thicker than the plot. All my S's ain't nothing, them hoes busted. All right, y'all, so I'm currently on the floor and we back up for y'all real quick. My butt hurt, y'all, but I'm done flat ironing my hair. My baby hairs are not done. I'm gonna do them tomorrow. There's no point in me doing them now because I'm about to lay down, but this is the look that I'm going for, like when it's all done. I'm gonna give Aliyah. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to give, don't think they know. I'm just playing out, but I'm done. So I'm done for the night, actually. This is the hair. But yeah, that's it. I'm gonna have to touch it up tomorrow, but she's done. And I try to do my part as neat as I can with a edge brush comb and my nails, though. She might not be that straight, but she's good enough. So yeah, I'll see y'all tomorrow. Good night. Hey y'all, good afternoon. It's currently 1.15, I think. And I woke up this morning, brushed my teeth, took a shower, and fixed my hair up because I had it in like a, I try to do a doobie and wrap it all around with my head scarf and my bonnet. But I don't know how well I did because I didn't have a hair net. So I couldn't put pins in it. I just had to hold it around my head and wrap it with both of my hands. I definitely have to cut some of my ends, um, at least in the front, because I cut my hair curly and it kind of looks choppy now because I cut it choppy when it was curly. Right now I'm about to just get ready for the day. I'm about to try on the two outfits I got from Amazon to see if I like them. Because if I like them, I'm gonna get them in every single color. So I wanna see if they fit me nice. That way I know I can order them for next time. So I'm about to try on them outfits from Amazon real quick and pick which one I'm gonna wear for the day if they do fit me right. This the first one. This the second one. Yes. Ew. That's cute. This one? This is mine, but I thought it was more brown. All right, as y'all can see, I'm already up. The face is a beat, y'all. And I just have a little two-piece pajama set, the ones that I showed y'all. But y'all basically have been watching me get it together this whole vlog. Like, I haven't done my hair a different style or got my nails done or my lashes done in so long. So I just feel so much more rejuvenated. You know what I'm saying? When you rejuvenate here, it makes you feel better mentally. I don't know the science behind it, but try it, y'all. Just do something for yourself. Before I go, y'all know I got Kaylin Collection on the lips. And speaking of Kaylin Collection, we are doing our our very first giveaway ever for my business Kaylin collection if you don't know and y'all the winner of the giveaway will be getting the whole entire it girl collection which is our three signature lip liners cocoa sweet tea and cookie butter and y'all will also get our four cream glosses which is skin type baby doll blush and birthday suit and by the way y'all all the information and details about this giveaway is going to be in the description box but also it will be in Kaylin collections instagram at Kaylin collection and of course i'll be doing updates about it on my personal page as well at my Kaylin. so all you gotta do is just stay in tune, y'all. Like, if you just in tune already, I appreciate you. But staying in tune just to get updates is what you gotta do. So, y'all, this is the step. So, I to be following at Kaylin Collection on Instagram and TikTok. At Kaylin Collection, y'all. It will be also in my description box down below the link. So, you can just follow it directly from there if you want to. Then, make a reel or a TikTok showcasing a lip combo, including Kaylin Collection. So, all you have to do is make a reel or a TikTok of you showing yourself doing a lip combo on your lips with the product or products 
from Kaylin Collection. And then finally, on that reel or TikTok post, make sure you guys tag at Kaylin Collection and do the hashtag Kaylin Collection so we can be able to review you and see you. But you have to be following Kaylin Collection on Instagram because when I pick the top three reels or TikTok, we are going to vote on my Instagram story. And that would determine who got the entire It Girl Collection. And some of y'all already bought the It Girl Collection and that's fine. If you want to enter too, you can enter too and give it to a friend. But I want to see y'all trying Kaylin Collection. So all you have to do is showcase the products in a reel or a TikTok and you can win the entire collection. And as a y'all, like I said, all the information is going to be on our Instagram at Kaylin Collection. So make sure you guys follow that when you guys enter the giveaway. So that's our giveaway, y'all. I'm so excited. But thank y'all for watching this video and I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye, y'all. I'm in. I'm waving like this. Anyways, bye. Mm-hmm.